<sighs> My channel is dying, guys. My channel is dying. My channel is dying. tough finding parking and what is up you guys i hope you're having a wonderful day i'm not sure if today is a good idea to go out and vlog because it's a saturday today and i'm going to gardens by the bay 2 which is prone to have a lot of uh, cyclists tonight but let's see let's see if i can go on a walking path and there will be lesser people hopefully so the last couple of days i got a couple of comments concern comments and as well hate comments but um I take it as concerned comments, yeah. Concerned comments such as, is my channel dying? And I can only say that yes and no. Ooh, ooh, I found a stairs going up to the highway. Let's go check it out. I think there'll be a good view up there. Hey guys, would you look at this? Stairs all the way up high onto this highway. I don't know if it's worth climbing up or not, but uh, I hate stairs, but if I don't go up, I will never know. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> hey, look, we are way up high already. Two more, two more to go. Two more flights. Woo. Whoa. Whoa. It's uh. It's not worth it. Don't climb up here. <laughs> I thought like I could get a good view, but uh, no, it's just up the highway. You know, sometimes I pick out commands <laughs> and I make a video out of it. I feel like today it's gonna be a bit of a walk. <laughs> All the time when we ride, we will ride through the PCN along there, along Marina Bay Sands, the Singapore Flyer and Gardens by the Bay. Beautiful sight. Now, today, I'm just walking inside the park of Gardens by the Bay 2. It's good because it doesn't seem like there's a lot of people around. And it's pretty dark, I might add. Let me give you a little idea of what I'm talking about. Look at this. Whoo! And then of course, in front there, that's the PCN. All the way there. I believe the concerns are arising is because I made so much changes on this channel. You know, like one vlog a week, it used to be two. You know, I used to post three videos a week. Now it's like two videos a week. I mean, being in the park is nice, guys. Nice lighted up trees and a beautiful landscape. Night landscape. You know, things like I'm doing too much wildlife videos. Hey, I do wildlife videos is because some of you guys enjoy them. Some of you guys want them. And if you go and look through my channel, the wildlife videos are the one that actually does the most views. So it's not that this channel is dying and I got nothing else to vlog about. Well, actually it's true. I got nothing else to vlog about. There's only so much you can do in Singapore. You will have to excuse me. I'm trying to do two things at once. I'm trying to make this vlog and at the same time trying to figure out how am I going to walk this park. It's hard for me to see the path without the lights because I have this flat light on my camera. So my vision of the dark has got really bad. <laughs> and the thing is, I understand some of you have come here and signed up for an adventure. Night adventure mostly. But honestly, it's not that I don't want to. It's hard to find places to do night adventure. And of course, you know, there is uh, social distancing and of course legal and illegal places. And also, my friends, they're all kind of busy. They all got their plans. I've always got to adjust, adapt, and figure out what's next. What's next for this channel. I mean, should I like take a moment and sit at this pavilion and then enjoy the nice spectacular view? So I've been doing YouTube for coming six years no actually it is six years six long years guys let's talk about growth 
I used to think that my channel it wasn't growing enough. You know, I used to think that it's not enough. I'm not doing enough on YouTube. I have to push, 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 push. I have to make more videos. I have to make more content. I would say like for the past two or three years, especially the time where I lost my job at Chili's, I was going YouTube hard. I was just pushing, 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 pushing the channel. You know, and I was trying all sorts of things to make my channel grow. You know, the last couple of days, I was watching some YouTube channels only because I was researching on a product. I was looking from top to bottom for this particular product review. I actually watch a lot of videos regarding on this um, specific product that I was looking at. And of course, when you search on YouTube, one, two, three, four, it's all usually the videos that are like the most view, you know, has the most subscribers. And I mean the famous channel, the channel that a lot of people notice. But what people don't notice and what they don't take into account is that there are thousand, and I mean thousand guys, thousand over channels doing the same particular product review in the world. Now I'll be first to tell you, there are channels that I come across that made the product review video so much better, so much high quality, so much standard, even a lot better than what I'm putting out on YouTube today. Even so much better than the videos that was posted by the famous YouTuber who has so many subscribers. I feel like small creators, or I would say thousand over channels in the world, are not getting the recognition that they deserve. I think that's something that YouTube should um, help the small creators, you know, help boost them. Because when I look at their subscribers, they're like 1,000 subscribers, 2,000. 3,000 at most. And guess what guys, they've been doing it even longer than I have. Now, the point I want to put here is that we always see the success of others. Sure, because they are successful, they are able to reach you, you are able to see them. It's like, hey, this guy, he made this food video, he got a million overviews. But what he don't understand is that there are 10,000, even 100,000 creators out there making that same food video to show the world and it's only this particular one guy or two or maybe three you know got i don't want to say lucky but they stand out and i feel like this youtube algorithm thing is really a hit or miss and i feel like it's always a lottery <laughs> when i first started till today how many channels have i shout out how many channels have i tried to promote and did not continue you know how many youtube channels have started along the same time as i have and they stop. You know, those channels are no longer posting videos or they have taken a break or whatever. I think what I'm trying to say here is that I'm grateful and I have to appreciate more of what my channel has given me. I mean, I've come a long way and I'm having 5,000, having 7,000 subscribers to this day. When there are 1,000 over channels out there in the world that do not get the exposure that they deserve. And I must count myself lucky. Lucky to be in this situation that um, I managed to get this far. Yes, lucky, maybe, but you also have to understand that there were lots of hard work put in, a lot of perseverance, a lot of persistence. Man, I'm bad with vocabulary. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. I think the most important thing is the drive to keep telling yourself, go, 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 and never give up. I think that's what I did. Would you check out that view? And of course, we have to walk on the PCN now because uh, the garden has stopped for a while. But I think straight in front, there will be more connecting to the garden. I tell you guys, when I'm riding here, <laughs> it's really fast. But when I'm walking, it like kind of takes forever. Yes, guys, this journey here, this vlog I made today, <laughs> it's taking a while. I know some of you are hating that I do the cinematic B-rolls. Okay, look, I'm not going to say hating. I would say concern. I know some of you are concerned about where the channel is moving to. Did you sign up for cinematic b-rolls? I'm sure you didn't. I will explain and I will address this, but this is a behind the scenes of one of the cinematic b-rolls that I did, and you gotta see Faiz. It is Valentine's Day, and I'm spending it with my buddy Faiz. Hi. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. I don't celebrate Valentine's Day. <laughs> but it is Valentine's Day today. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm with you. Mm. How romantic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna throw you in the water. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.
tonight we are here at Gardens by the Bay and as you can see Marina Bay Sands beautiful at the background we are here just doing a little b-roll a little cinematic work and it's um it's going good so far <laughs> today I'm gonna show you some of the behind the scenes of what we do and Faiz is out here tonight to help me with some of the b-rolls now some of the b-rolls taken today have already been included in the cinematic b-roll that I pulled posted the other day here here here's the link so sometimes shots like that it might not make it in the final cut because i don't know why Faiz likes taking plants <laughs> why do you like to take plants Faiz? who do like nature <laughs> so so far you have seen like two of my cinematic b-roll work on youtube generally each video i would visit like five to six different places and then just take clips and the best out of it and then all put it into one video so usually what i like to do with the b-roll is that i like to have a closer uh, subject and then a nice foreground pick a spot like this like this dragonfly thing i would like to frame the dragonfly at the same time play with my depth of field which is the aperture 1.4 over here on this 50 millimeter 50 millimeter <laughs> kind of give a nice cinematic look out of it i keep saying cinematic look i, I don't know how to describe it but uh, it is cinematic look and the thing is that i've always been filming with a prime lens so one thing you have to take note that prime lens they have no uh, stabilizer you got to use a tripod most of the time and it's just like a 10 second clip because i'm going to slow it down and i'll include it on my b-roll so the reason why i've been doing cinematic b-rolls is that for one i told you guys in the previous vlog that what i wanted to do is to showcase my work and practice all the cinematic bureau and practicing my editing as well number two this channel is gonna kind of like be more camera and more camera gears and lens that's because this is what i enjoy doing i enjoy filming i'm not saying i'm an expert in <laughs> cinematic work but um i'll get there and you guys watching me you guys get to follow me on my journey of learning and hopefully you guys can learn something as well and also if you guys have any tips you guys can leave it on the comment section below and i will learn something as well so this is why when i have a setup i usually keep the same setup for each video today i'm filming with the 800d with the canon 50 millimeter f1.4 the previous cinematic b-roll you saw it was with the m6 mark ii with the sigma 18 to 35 mm f 1.8 very tech <laughs> If I, the thing is my camera is old so the ISO performance is not that great there's lots of noise in my image <laughs> especially at low light hey Faiz what if I hire you one day I mean the salary must have been really good <laughs> <laughs> what do you think guys should I hire Faiz leave your comments down below if I should fire, hire fire fire yes, fire, 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 <laughs> hire Faiz because I think Faiz have been doing a very good um, B-roll and um, camera work. Do you think Faiz is a good camera guy? Am I the worst? <laughs> no, he's not the worst, for sure. You know, sometimes it's just like that. When you come all the way here to film Gardens by the Bay and you want to take the, like, um, the glowing, the bright lighted fake trees, it's switched off. <laughs> the lights are not on today, but MBS it's lighted up it happens guys this is behind the scenes behind the scenes of our cinematic work what? <laughs> yeah 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 Faiz you and your bright lights <laughs> yep they're not switched on today why? why would they switch it off? on valentine's day Faiz they want you to go home and make babies Faiz you choose the weirdest place for framing you know that? I mean look two testicles <laughs> <Why is it? laughs> really, you guys should never subscribe to Faiz's channel Unless you want testicles <laughs> Wow, I must say, this is a very rare sight, guys I've never seen it all switched off Faiz, have you ever seen it this way? Nope Like, all switched off? No Yeah, me too And welcome back <laughs> Now, if you didn't know the difference where I am here is Gardens by the Bay 2 Where I went with Faiz the other day 
it was Gardens by the Bay 1. Over there, that's where the artificial lightings and all that. Here is more of a quiet park and good for viewing the whole landscape of Singapore. And I'm almost towards the end of Gardens by the Bay 2 and I see a playground over there. But uh, guys, check out the view. Ooh. This is towards the end of the pier. Can I go down? I think I can go down. Well, okay, I thought it was a beach, but <laughs> no, it's not. And I think it's low tide now. Okay, let's get Tobo. Yay, now you guys get to see. This is the end of the southern part of Singapore. I didn't know we can drive here. <laughs> I would have drive here. Well, there's a road all the way here at the end. But I think that's the end of the PCN now. Hmm. I think I should really wrap this up. <laughs> I was here, I wanted to come to Gardens by the Bay 2 to see at the end of the pier and see what's up, but uh, nothing much. Just a playground that is uh, closed because of COVID. <laughs> yeah. For those of you who have followed my channel for a long time now, you guys know that I like making changes. I like adjusting. And that's the reason why you signed up for Living Like Liner. I try to make things fresh. I try to give you variety. I try to do different stuff. Say like one day you may not see any more wildlife video because I do something different. You know, I don't always stick to wildlife, wildlife, wildlife throughout my entire five years on YouTube. Then I think that's going to be a little boring. It's living like liner, not being bored with liner. So what I can assure you is that doing this cinematic B-roll, it is completely normal. Well, actually it's not completely normal. I don't usually just do this, but... Uh, <laughs> I don't want to give so much away because it'll be kind of like spoiling the surprise if you know what I mean. And I also don't want to tell you guys like, hey, my members and my Patreon, they know what I'm planning. They know what's coming up. Because you guys are going to hate me for that. Ooh, Otter's Crossing. Over here. Wow, that view. That view. And to answer your question at the start of today's vlog, is my channel dying? Yes. All the old stuff, all the old vlogs that you see, the old style, they are dead. <laughs> no, they are not dead. But change is coming. There will be lots of change. I have a plan. A plan is coming up and I just don't want to spoil it for you guys. No. <laughs> so is my channel dying? No. Because... <laughs> I don't want to give it away. I don't want to give too much away but... Um... I hope you enjoyed today's vlog and I will see you in the next one. You guys keep smiling. See ya! You guys are gonna hate me. <laughs> I'm not gonna leave you with a cliffhanger. There will be a new season. That's all I'm giving. I'm happy guys. I am happy. This channel is far from dying. Like, I'm happy to be here and I'm happy to change stuff. And I'm happy to give you guys something fresh every single time. I mean, new plans, new direction. The most important thing is I do have a plan. And it's not like I'm lost. New season, and for those of you who know what a new season means, then... There you go. Where are we? <laughs> I don't know. Pasir <laughs> Panjang. Right. <laughs> and we're going for Nasi Lemak. This is $7.10. Not bad, isn't it, Faiz? Quite pricey. Yeah. Well, you are drinking Milo only. Yeah. <laughs> I don't feel like eating. So, dinner was awesome. Faiz, did you enjoy dinner? I mean, I had drinks. <laughs> you had dinner. <laughs> he ordered a hot drink and a cold drink. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways, we will see you soon, Faiz. We'll catch up again soon. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully right. on a bike la, next time. Oh yeah, yeah. Faiz love riding.